Hi everybody, it's Terry with paperologist.blogspot.com and I'm coming to you as a member of the Cutting Cafe video design team and today I want to show you how to convert a PDF file which you can purchase from the Cutting Cafe into a cut file for your craft robo. And I made these cards um, on my silhouette and I'm going to use this bunny image which is available at the Cutting Cafe. So we're going to go into the zipped file and I'm going to show you what that looks like. This is what you download from the Cutting Cafe. You double click on it and if you have a PC machine you pick Extract All Files. We have three PDF files here and a WPC. The WPC is for a puzzle machine which I don't own. So we're going to convert one of these PDFs into a cut file. So I'm going to pick Extract All Files, Next. I'm going to save it to my desktop, pick Next and finish. The zipped file here I'm going to save as a backup because if you ever have a machine crash you want to save all these files on an external drive or a CD. Let's go ahead and open up the PDF now. And I have the full version of Acrobat. I'm going to use this tool here which is a crop tool and I'm going to crop out the words and I'm going to try to get as close as I can to get as little white space as possible. It's not a critical step, but it's helpful. I just double clicked. I'm going to pick OK to crop. Now I'm going to show you a couple things. If you're familiar with Acrobat, you probably know that you can either export an image as a JPEG or you can save an image as a JPEG. So we're going to do that first because we want to import a JPEG file into our Silhouette software. So that's the Save as JPEG. Now, I've learned and I'm going to show you both ways. I'm also going to pick Save as a PNG file. And I'm going to name that PNG. Pick Save. Okay, we're going to minimize this. I'm going to go into the RoboMaster software. I already have a page open and I do not have registration marks turned on and I have it set up for 8.5 by 12. Go to the Insert menu, pick File, and let's insert the JPEG first. Now you notice that I'm getting an error here. So the workaround that I figured out was to do this. Go back out, open up your PNG file, pick Open with Paint, go to File, pick Save As, and once again pick JPEG, but we're going to just name this PNG JPEG. Pick Save. Go ahead and close that. Let's go back into RoboMaster, Insert, File, JPEG. That was my, uh, I'm going to do that again for you. Insert, File, this one, the PNG JPEG. And there it is. So we'll take out that one. Once again, if we go Insert File, just that first JPEG, we're going to get an error. So now we have this document. We need to convert it to outline so that we can cut it out now. You can see the outline of the image here. Pick Outer Frame Only, Convert to Outline, Paste, then Exit. Now, right now it's grouped. It's grouped the JPEG PNG and it's the cut file or the outline file. So we're going to pick ungroup, click over here, pick it back up, and we're going to move it. This is the file you would use if you wanted to print and cut, but I'm going to remove that. So now we're going to scale him to whatever size you want, and let's rotate him, and let's do 90 degrees. He's upside down. You could stretch it at this point, make a tall bunny. Let's mirror him vertical. You would go to your cut menu here, pick OK, and set it up to cut. So that's how you import a PDF if you have the full version of Acrobat. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them. And I'm going to do another video showing you how to convert your PDF through Photoshop. Thanks again. Have a great day.